Hello trader, welcome to my channel. This video will teach you how to know how much I want to risk in a particular trade. Let me say I want to open a set position with this particular loss size now. I open one particular position now, as you can see. Click on this line that is there. That is the line. Let me show you how you can know how much I want to lose in this new version of Meta to Five. Then drag it. To, I want to set my stop loss right to this particular place. Look at this thing here. You can see the value is increasing as time goes on. The more the more I raise it, the more it increases the the amount you can see let me stop at four dollars so if this trade happens to go against me i'm going to lose four dollars let me say i, I added one position to still that four dollars this is because the four dollar dollar is only applicable in one particular position even as i'm opening one position more position it's applicable in one position let me say i want to add tp now all you need to do is just click at that position the otp and then drag it to the place you want your dp to be this value here is the amount you are going to make 7.3 if this trade happens to go for us you understand guys you are going to make seven dollars then click on that arrow there and you see your stop loss and you take profit first of all copy your stop loss since you open more than one particular trade now modify the trade and then go and set that stop loss on other trades do you understand because i open three particular position you can see let me show you guys in this particular position we have tp and as well as stop loss so that's it but for the second one there's no tp and stop loss as well as the last one so let's go ahead and put our stop loss and our tp by swiping and clicking on that pencil icon and then paste our stop loss has now been modified then let me do the same thing in the other trade as well it wouldn't have been so as me i opened the position at different levels but i stacked the, i stacked the position at one particular place that's why it's like this guys so let me put for tp take profit i copy the value then go and modify it for the second and the third one as well so that's it guys let's modify it if you do modify it i like it to keep using money why that's our fit or stop loss but as mean i open this trade at different particular at different places it shouldn't have been so i'll just touch the line and then modify it by just dragging the the tool to the place where it's supposed to be so that's it guys i hope you, i hope you are getting what i'm doing now look at this particular position it's going against us it is still four dollars when this trade happens to go back to that place it's going to be four dollar loss you understand guys that's what the symbol is for those of you that have the new method to your five you understand so let me show you what later happened okay look at this one it's not three dollars because i happen to click on the line of the other trade you understand guys that's why it's three point eight now just click on the line as you open the trade at different position different value would have been occurred you understand guys Few minutes, few moments for these trades, guys. We are still in loss. <laughs> we are still in loss. So the, the, the trade is going against us. I just want to show you that after everything, I'm going to lose four dollars for the first trade, and then three dollars or so for the three point eight or three point nine for the other trade. So after everything, we happen to hit the loss, the stop loss. So let me go and show you. Let's go to this trade. Let me show you what's happening. You can see the first trade is four point zero. That one point zero point one is the charges that they used to collect. Then the second one is 3.9. You understand, guys? That's plus charges. You understand? Before it was 3.8 something. That's it, guys. I use the more account for this trade, for this practice, guys. This thing is applicable for both currency pairs and synthetic indices. If you want to trade synthetic indices, the link to open account is in the description of this particular video, guys. So that's it, guys. I hope you have learned something today. If this video was helpful, do me a favor by liking my video and subscribing to my channel. See you in my next video, guys. Bye.